For the past nine years, Shelly has ruled the mansion. Hi, Ed. Hi, girls. Hi, Hi. Shelly. Looking good. But today, she's about to get a wake-up call. They're kicking me out. Maybe it's because of your age. But I'm 27. But that's 59 in bunny years. I don't have anything. I don't know what to do. You need a yap. A yap. Yeah. This summer, it looks like a bunch of little Playboy mansions. She's looking for a place to call home. Do you ladies go to school here too? We're the house mothers of the sororities. This would be perfect for me. This is not a brothel. Oh, I'm not looking to make soup. Try Zeta. Their last house mother was hospitalized with hallucinations. Awesome. Now. Hello? Sometimes when you need help. How can we be so smart, but everyone kind of thinks we're losers? Reading, earthling. <laughs> The person you least expect. My name is Shelly, and I'm here to be your house mother. Will be exactly what you need. We have to be popular. Guys like her. And since guys don't like us, I figured Shelly here could teach us how. I am just so happy that you guys want me here. This is Harmony. Harmony. And then Joanne. Joanne. What is that? It's just this thing I do to remember people's names. Natalie. You hired the exorcist, that's great. From Happy Madison, who brought you 50 first dates. Shelly, that's Colby. I'm in love with him. That's so sweet, how long have you guys been going out? I've never even talked to him. By the time I'm done, every girl on campus will want to pledge Zeta. He's changing their style. That's it, lady. Now we can be the best versions of ourselves. You're pretty pleased with yourself, aren't you? I am a little proud. Don't mess with me. <sighs> And they're giving her the education of a lifetime. So I met this boy named Oliver. He didn't fall for any of my tricks. I think I dropped some money over here. Maybe it's over here by this manhole. Ah! That is freaking hot! Anna Ferris is the house bunny. What if Oliver doesn't mind a smart girl? Ah! Have you given any thought to who you might be voting for? Definitely won't listen to what Simon says. He is just so mean. I usually always agree with Paula and Randy. Oh, you meant the president. 